hi guys this is amar and welcome to network engineer stuff so guys in this video we are going to see that how we can configure message of the day that is motd and login banners in cisco routers and we are going to see this in cisco packet trace guys this video is going to be a bit short video but at the same time this video is going to be very informational video and very important video for the guys who are preparing for ccna so there are some steps which are given on the left end you can see over here the five steps are given here and we have to follow these instructions uh, to configure MOTD and banner login banner so let's let's go by step one is saying that login into Pune router using PC1 so we go into this PC1 we are using Cisco packet tracer so in PC1 we have this option over here command prompt okay so yes this is my command prompt and uh, it is saying that uh, login into the Pune router and the IP of the Pune router is already given to us so it is I will do telnet to 10.1.1.1 so I have been logging into this the username is Amar password is Cisco123 and the enable password is also Cisco one two three. Fine. So now we have to set message of the day and the login banner. So let's see how to set message of the day. I'll go into the config terminal. The command is very 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 simple, guys. Uh, the command is banner. If you give question mark, you'll find two options currently over here: login and message of the day. So first we'll set message of the day. So this is message of the day. I'll give a question mark. You can see here we can have to give the message of the day message. Uh, it is saying that uh, we should give this banner text will be here and there is the wrote here C uh, before the banner text and after the banner text. Where C is a delimiting character. So you can give any delimiting character. Let's say I use the delimiting character here as hash. I'll press enter and then I'll give a banner. Let's say I'm giving a banner. Uh, welcome to network engineer stuff. Okay. And I'll end it with, let's say hash. Okay. So my message of the day is configured. Uh, let's also configure the login banner. So again, the command is banner followed by login here also same thing we have to give a delimiting character before and after the banner text so again i'll give an hash no problem and uh, i'll give uh, let's say the login banner as authorized members are allowed fine now we will see where uh, the message of the day and login banners are seen. So I'll exit completely from uh, this particular router and I'll do again 10.1.1.1 .1 and you can see here that I put it 10.1.1.1 and uh, uh, it, it, it opened that connection opened and it immediately gives me the message of the day. So message of the day comes first and after that you can see authorized members are allowed this is my login banner so message of the day followed by login banner you can see over here and then you can easily access your device uh, your, your username was amar and password was cisco123 and the the password was also cisco123 again to uh, to, to delete uh, this banners again the command is very simple i'll go into config terminal and to know banner message of the day and no banner login now if you see i'll again try to log in you won't see any banner and any message of the day okay so this is how uh, we can set message of the day and uh, banner login uh, in 
on on Cisco devices. So guys, this was a very short video, but again, as I told, it's a very informational video and again, very important video to understand. Uh, many of you guys who are working uh, currently in in, uh, in in most of the enterprises networks or ISPs, they may be aware of these things, but guys who are preparing for CCNA for them, uh, this is very important, uh, cons uh, very, 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 very important chapter, I'll say, uh, related to banners. So guys, if you need this particular lab, uh, you can uh, let me know. I can I can I can provide you with this particular file, uh, or or any other uh, Cisco packet tracer uh, lab which I do on my on my YouTube channel network engineer stuff. You can you can let me know if you want. You can mail me, or you can also you know comment me in the comment section. I'll try to provide you the same. So guys, I'll stop you stop here in this video. Uh, and get back to you in the next video. Till then, bye. Thanks and have a nice day. Thank you.